myself Sital Singh from News Moment. Welcome you to News Moment English. Breaking news: Asansol. Three children drowned in a mine in Asansol stone quarry in KD Sim Koyleri area of Asansol North Police Station area. Three children are reported to have drowned. It is being told that children had gone to bath in the abandoned stone quarry located there. During that time, they drowned. The incident caused a sensation in the area. People have gathered to search for the children. Police and driving teams have also been called. News number one: Sitapur. After the arrest of Mahant Bajrang Muni in Sitapur district of Uttar Pradesh. Late on Wednesday night, his supporters created a ruckus. The police officers kept talking to Mahan's supporters continuously, but things gradually deteriorated. Police lathi charged on the supporters of Mahan. This news is sponsored by TVSPSJ. Sitapur, Uttar Pradesh. According to Santranj Prasad, the police arrested Mahan. Bajrang Muni, who made objectionable remarks against Muslim women, at the same time, after the arrest, Mahant Bajrang Muni has been sent to judicial custody for fourteen days by the local court. Let us tell you that in Sitapur, the police arrested Mahant Bajrang Muni Das and presented him in the court. Mahant had made objectionable remarks about Muslim women a few days ago. The video of Mahant Bajrang Muni threatening women. With rape, became very viral on the social media. After which, there was a demonstration at regarding the, his arrest. The National Commission for Women had also taken cognizance of the hate speech. Commission's chairperson Rekha Sharma had written a letter to the Director General of Police of Uttar Pradesh to immediately intervene in the matter and register an FIR against Mahant. In this case, Director General of Police, Law and Order, Prashant Kumar, held a point and told that the police has arrested Mahant Bajrang Muni of Maharishi Sri Lakshman Das Udasi Ashram. Muni has been arrested under Sections 153A, 154A, 298, and 509 of the Indian Penal Code. Let us tell you during the procession in Khairabad on 2nd April, Mahant Bajrang Muni Das made a controversial statement about the women of a particular community in front of the glass mosque. The video of his statement also went viral. After which, the Women's Commission took cognizance of the matter and called for a reply from the DGP. Stay with us for more news after the break. Step in. Rainbow dresses for all types of kids wear. Bastin Bazaar Mall, GT Road, Asansol. Rainbow Big Shop. All varieties of ladies wear, men's wear, and suit pieces are also available. Bastin Bazaar, GT Road, Asansol. Contact number. Zero three four one triple two one five nine zero. Rainbow Big Shop. News number two. Temperature of the atmosphere is increasing. It has affected schools also. This news is sponsored by Motion. Asansol. According to Sita Ram, instructions to morning section of primary schools by West Bardwan District Primary Education Council in primary schools of the district during summer because instructions have been issued to start morning classes from Monday. All the schools will run in the morning section. Classes will be held from 6:30 a.m. to 11:30 a.m. At the same time, according to the government instructions issued earlier, the summer vacation will be from. Seventeenth May to eleventh June. Stay with us for more news after the break. बोल रही हूँ मेरा नाम इशिता पटचारी है ये शाइना एकेडमी हम लोगों ने 2017 में स्टार्ट किया है ये एकेडमी है स्किल डेवलपमेंट कोर्सेज के लिए जो स्किल डेवलपमेंट कोर्सेज करने के बाद बच्चे लोग अपने पैर पे खड़ा हो सकते हैं क्योंकि ये सारे कोर्सेज जो हम लोग करवाते हैं वो सारे जॉब ओरिएंटेड कोर्सेज हैं 
यहाँ पे हम लोग टैली जी एस टी डिटर्स मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम एडवांस एक्सेल हार्डवेयर नेटवर्किंग मोबाइल रिपेयरिंग ब्यूटिशियन बेकिंग का कोर्सेज पाइथन सी प्लस प्लस जावा पर्सनैलिटी मैनेजमेंट एंड स्पोकन इंग्लिश ये सारे कोर्सेज हम लोग अभी यहाँ पे रन करवा रहे हैं अगर कोई ये कोर्सेज सीखना चाहते हैं तो नीचे आप लोगों के साथ नंबर चार है आप लोग इसको कॉन्टैक्ट कर सकते हैं ये सेंटर हम लोग का एस बी का रोड में News number three, lack of beer in the state. Demand increased in summer at the end of Chetra. Various parts of the state, the temperature has crossed 40 degrees Celsius in the district, and Beshak will begin a day later. This news is sponsored by India International School. Meteorological department is not giving any hope of rain. The heat will increase in the Beshak. It is not clear whether Kal Baisakhi will come or not. Some are some people were drinking beer and keeping the throat and body cool. But there is a shortage of beer in the state. Due, due to this, the excise department is allotting beer to the vendors through the ration system. The reason of this is the shortage of beer in the state. This is not as much supply as there is demand. And to deal with this, the state excise department is started to Rationing of the supply of beer, exactly the same amount of beer that is stored sold a year ago in April 2021, will now be supplied. The excise department has also set a policy for this. Although the excise department claims that the state is not producing enough beer, according to the demand, vendors are making other complaint. According to him, the excise department does not have adequate supply system. Therefore, the beer crisis is. deepening in the shops in the district however the state excise commissions commissioner s uma shankar had rubbed the allegations acknowledging the supply problem he said low production has created some problems in general beer production starts from january to meet the summer demand but production was interrupted at the time due to an omicron infection all the same time The demand for beer is also high. Demand has also increased due to the fall in prices. Stay with us for more news after the break. Admission is open now at Saint Christopher Mission School, run by Anglican Society, affiliated to CBSC Delhi. Special features are low affordable fee structure, smart class. well trained teachers indoor outdoor games transport facility co curricular activities classes from nursery to 12 it's time for your child to explore the creativity thank you Revision of the employees of Ferro Scar Corporation Limited, which was pending since 1st January 2017. Today, JFC, an agreement was reached between the management and the union during the meeting. This information was given by Harjit Singh, president of Ferro Scar Permanent Employees Union (INTUC) Banpur. Banpur according to Sujit Singh Gupta an agreement has been reached between the Ferro Scar Permanent Employees Union INTUC President Harjit Singh management and the union of the Banpur some of the main points of gaya salary revision as follows first over basic as on 31st December 2016 done with MGB at that time With existing DA of twelve percent, second, PAGs will get twenty five percent over revised basic. Third, company contribution of six percent over basic pay under pension contribution. Fourth, all arrears outstanding from first January two thousand seventeen will be paid in one go. Fifth, house rent allowance. Pre revised 2012, it was decided by the central government to pay the basic pay according to the category of the city as per the rules. Stay with us for more news after the break. Rekha matching. Please step in for all kinds of colorful 
मैचिंग पॉपलिन रूबिया फैंसी दुपट्टाज अदर फैंसी ड्रेस मेटेरियल्स टीपी मार्केट आसनसोल फॉर मोर इन्फॉर्मेशन प्लीज कॉन्टैक्ट नाइन सिक्स थ्री फाइव सिक्स फोर जीरो जीरो न्यूज नंबर फाइव आसनसोल टू फैक्शन ऑफ तृणमूल कांग्रेस क्लैस थ्री इन हॉस्पिटल The situation become tense due to a fight between two groups of Trinamool in Mohisila area of ward number 42 of Asansol Municipal Corporation. Three people injured in this incident were taken to the hospital. There is a tense situation in the area after the incident. There is huge resentment among the people of the area after the late night fight. A group alleges that last night some people were abusing while intoxicated and the Trinamool workers were beaten up for protesting the same people who beat up are also from trinamool party the same other group is accusing this people stay with us for more news after the break ab asan sol mein aa gaya hai ananta residency with various facilities ananta residency name you can trust kyunki ye hai asan sol ka ek matr eco friendly and techno friendly residential project boom barrier ड्रेनेज इलेक्ट्रिसिटी कनेक्शन वाटर कनेक्शन सीसीटीवी कैमरा हरियर बाबा मंदिर 25 गार्डन्स, स्वयं हेल्थ मॉनिटरिंग मशीन विद एक्सपर्ट डॉक्टर कंसल्टेंट एंड मेडिटेशन सेंटर के अलावा अन्य विशेषताओं के साथ माय गेट सिक्योरिटी सर्विस ऐप की सुविधा यहां उपलब्ध है मात्र 19 लाख रुपए में मिलेंगे टू बी एच के विथ प्लॉट और पच्चीस लाख रूपए में मिलेंगे थ्री बी एच के विथ प्लॉट ओनरशिप के साथ नई शुरुआत नई उमंग अनंता रेसिडेंसी के संग बाईपास घाघरबुड़ी मंदिर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड मैनेजमेंट कॉलेज आसनसोल न्यू बस स्टैंड और तैयार हो रहे होलसेल मार्केट के करीब मौजूद है अनंता रेसिडेंसी तो देर ना करें आज ही बुकिंग करें हमारा पता है नियर माँ घाघरबुड़ी मंदिर बागबंदी रोड बाईपास आसनसोल कॉन्टेक्ट नंबर न्यूज नंबर सिक्स ई सी एल इंटर एरिया बॉडी बिल्डिंग पावर लिफ्टिंग एंड वेट लिफ्टिंग वन डे चैंपियनशिप कंपटीशन 2021-2022 बांकोला एरिया चैंपियन एंड ईसीएल हेड क्वार्टर्स वाज रनर अप संतोरिया अकॉर्डिंग टू वर्किंग एडिटर विकास प्रसाद ईसीएल इंटर एरिया बॉडी बिल्डिंग पावर लिफ्टिंग एंड वेट लिफ्टिंग वन डे चैंपियनशिप कंपटीशन विल बी ऑर्गेनाइज्ड एट ईसीएल हेड क्वार्टर्स ऑन वेडनेसडे के झाल बागान एट डिसरगर क्लब It was inaugurated by ECL CMD Technical Secretary Niladri Rai by lighting the lamp. Director Technical Planning Project and Operations Jay Prakash Gupta distributed the prize. According to the information about 20 ECL personnel from different areas participated in the weight lifting, power lifting and body building championship competition organized. Bankola area was victorious in this championship competition while ECL head quarter was the runner up. Munna Mandal of Bankola area was the champion in power lifting of the competition. Nafaron Bose of Sonpur Bazari area was the runner up in border building. Tirth Gopal Mandal stood first, Sandeep Ghosh second and Samir to the third. Addressing this initial director, Technical Jayaprakash Gupta said that keeping our body fit by participating in various sports competitions, he said that this is a good start. This will motivate the employees of ECL to become physically capable. He talked about taking this game further. It is noteworthy that it is the third year of such a game in the ECL. It was started in the year 2018. This time 20 employees have participated in this game. Malayathri Bose of KKSC Union, Madhav Banerji of UTUC, Nitunjay Singh of BMS and others were present on the occasion stay with us for more news after the break angel vidya mandir a seer word to success we provide classes from 8 to 10 11 to 12 graduation we also provide all types of competitive class like ssc rail wbcs and state level exams for more information contact 9932864067 or Eight double one six one eight three zero seven nine. News number seven. In the scorching heat of the sun, Scout Group distributed sherbet among the passers-by. Scout Group of DAV School Asansul organized social service to passers-by. People are experiencing ex- extreme heat while on the road. They are feeling thirst. 
In different places, there is no arrangement of drinking water. In such circumstances, water or sorbet gives great relief to the people. It is appreciable. Stay with us for more news after the break. Want to be a doctor? Hold the hands of an expert by D.K. Lal Sir. Address Rishi Arbin Nagar Villa Road, Kulti, Pashim Bardwan. For more information, contact 9832824975. News number 8. In Navaghanti area under Hirapur police station, a person named Mahendra Yadav has been accused of cutting off three fingers of Manish Yadav's hand from the area. At the same time, this matter was now taken in a political color. According to Surjit Singh Gupta, the attacker is being claimed to be a BJP supporter and the injured TMC supporters. Whereas political parties and police say that this incident has nothing to do with politics. This incident happened due to personal dispute. It is alleged that Mahendra Yadav cut off all the three fingers of Manish Yadav's hand. In the night of 12th April, with his sword attack, the injured Manish Yadav has been admitted to his hospital in Banpur from treatment. After the incident, the father of the victim Manish Yadav is demanding justice for his son while going round the administration with the three fingers cut off. In this regard, TMC leader former councillor Farad Das said that politics has nothing to do with this incident. This is the result of a dispute over the SOP in the area. At the same time, it was also said that police a con conspiracy is being made to give a political color to this matter. This is a personal dispute. Stay with us for more news after the break. Biofina, drink healthy, stay healthy, lychee flavor. For trade inquiry, mail care at the rate of rkmgroup.in. Contact toll free number 1800258706. News number 9 Asansur Club Premier League Asansur Club Premier League Cricket Tournament will be held from 21st May to 23rd in the style of IPL. For this auction the players at Asansur Club last night auction has been held. There are 75 players for a total of 5 teams. Auction of 60 people is the remaining 15 players will own and co on five teams. An organizing committee was formed for the competition. It will be inaugurated on 20 May. It includes Sovon Narayan Basu, Rakesh Gopalka, Suprabhat Viswas, Gagandeep Singh Saluja, and Avisek Gopalka. Club members and their relatives and families are included. The competition will be held from 21st May to 23rd. Editor Sovan Narayan Basu said that for the first time this event has been organized and everyone is excited. At the same time, players are brought with virtual money. There is no real money transaction. Asansul Club Premier League see a list of different teams. Night Warriors, Honor Mr. Somnath Viswal, Co-Honor Mr. Avisek Gopalka, Co-Honor Mr. Kunal Sultanya. Super Strikers Honor Mr. Sukhvinder Singh Bita Honor Mr. Gagandeep Singh Saluja Bini Co Honor Mr. Ronak Chabra Asansul Tigers Honor Mr. Anand N. Agrawal Honor Mr. Vijay Jain Co Honor Mr. C. S. Narayan Murli Heartland Dragons Honor Mr. Mukesh Agrawala Honor Mr. Manish Kumar Bagaria. Co honor Mr. Binit Jain. Asansul Sachs. Honor Mr. Rahul Agrawal. Honor Mr. Avis Ashish Patel. Co honor Mr. Ritesh Sau. Stay with us for more news after the break. Like, share, and subscribe and forward YouTube channel News Moment. For more details and for advertisement, contact editor 9563830. News number 10. The Delhi Police has told the Supreme Court that there were no instances of hate speeches at the Hindu Yuba Vahini event, nor was there, as alleged, any open call for genocide of Muslims in order to achieve ethnic 
cleansing the words spoken were instead about empowering one's religion to prepare itself to face the evils which could endanger its existence which is not even remotely connected to a call for genocide of any particular religion none of the words spoken in any manner whatever overly and explicitly described indian muslims as territory and as predators of land livelihood on the hindu women and nothing was said or done which could create an environment of a paranoia among any religion caste or creed the counter affidavit filed by the delhi police through isha pande deputy commissioner of police southeast delhi submitted the affidavit was in reply to a petition filed by kwarban ali a journalist and anjana prakash a former high court judge the petitioners has alleged that event in haridwar and delhi in december to 2021 witnessed hate speeches delivered by the, with the apparent objective of declaring war against a significant section of the indian citizenry they had shot an independent credible and impartial investigation into the alleged incidents of hate speeches against the muslim community the police said the fundamental freedom of speech could not be suppressed unless it created a situation that was pressing or if it endangered community interest and anticipated danger should be not remote far fetched the police noted the expressions in the speech made at delhi event were not intrinsically dangerous to public interest sms of the moment the one who plants trees knowing that he will never sit in their set has at least started to understand the meaning of life thank you for watching our video if you liked it then please share subscribe the video don't forget to push the bell icon for further notification